Hey guys, so I am about to wrap a present. I am um, sitting here on my floor in front of my beautiful Christmas tree and my husband George and I are up wrapping presents for our girls. And um, I usually leave this up to my husband to do the wrapping of the gifts and I do gift bags, but I'm going to wrap one of their presents blind, completely blind. And I'm really excited about this, which my husband is happy for me because yeah, he's he's enjoying doing the gift bags tonight, so I'm going to try to wrap this VR um, headset for my girls. So um, anyway, it's a really big box, and I have this really pretty wrap paper my husband picked out, um, and I like it because he knows I like metallics, it's silver, and it has Santa Clauses on it. So um, it's going to be really pretty, and so I've rolled it out, and now I'm going to lay this box on top of the paper. And hold on. So I'm not going to be able to film and do this all at the same time, but I'll show you all my steps. So I've laid out the paper. Now I'm going to put the box on top of the paper. Hold on one second. Pause for a second. Okay, so now I have the box on top of the paper and I have kind of measured it out, folded the paper, wrapped it over the, back, uh, the box here to make sure I know how much to cut. Um, over here on the left hand side, I've got to cut it from the roll. So yes, I think this is going to work. Okay, so now, now to cutting a straight line. <laughs> yeah, good luck, Joy. Now I have to, before I cut that, that the paper from the roll, I'm going to put a piece, piece of tape right here to hold this uh, paper on the box. So that's all ready to okay, go. I just put a piece of tape right here. That was all, that was fun trying to make sure it's hard getting a piece of tape to uh, lay right on an edge that you can't really see, but I did it. It worked. Okay, now to cut the paper. Okay, so y'all, before I cut the paper, I just had a good idea of what I was going to do um, before I cut it. So I folded, so the box is sitting on the paper. I taped one of the sides of the paper to the box, and then I flipped the paper on the roll over the box. So now the box is covered with wrapping paper. The roll is now resting on the right side of the box. It started on the left. And I am going to... Um, so now you can see the paper here underneath that I've taped, um, and I, you can see the paper here on, above it that is laying over the box. So this will help me, uh, it gives me a guide to know where to cut this paper because I want this paper to meet, kind of overlap so I can tape it and then fold the sides. So I'm going to cut a little bit over this edge here of this paper. Um, so I'm going to cut, try to cut as best as I can a straight line. Um, I might try to aim just, it's okay if it's not perfectly down the middle, but I'm gonna give myself a little extra room and cut it towards this right side of the box. Um, and then I can fold the paper under any extra to make the seam straight down the middle. Okay, let's try this. <laughs> okay, so that was fun. I just cut, um, kind of down the middle no i mean it worked i yeah i'm gonna fix this i have a little it kind of like made a little cut here in the paper on the edge but i can fold this so i'm gonna fold the edge under because i gave myself extra room sorry i'm watching uh christmas vacation on my tv so i love chevy chase christmas vacation movie so it's in the background so that's the noise you're hearing so i'm going to fold this under because i have room to fold the little lip under to make it more down the, the seam down the middle and that will camouflage the little rip that i have right here that i did with a scissor okay so i'm going to fold that under and then tape it so yeah <laughs> fun fun okay actually i just realized i don't have to fold it under because when i was folding it under i realized that i kind of did already have it down the center so this is going to work. So now I'm just going to tape it down the middle. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Can I movie? <laughs> oh my gosh, I love this movie. Okay, so I'm going to tape it down the middle. Okay, so tape job is done. Mm, you know, it's okay. Um, very hard to put tape, um, yeah, across uh, a seam blindedly just by touch. And I Someone did it really nicely. I mean, you know, hey, I'll try it with your eyes closed and see how well it works. It's hard, but I did it. It's probably not as gorgeous as I would have done it with eyesight, but it works, you know? 
the papers together and it's not really, you know, uh, uh, what do you call it? It's just not bunchy. It's really good. It's nice and smooth and yeah, there's no gaps. So I call that successful. <laughs> okay. Now to fold, fold the, the, uh, the sides in. Okay. Y'all with me still? And so I also, before I folded in the sides, I taped the center part of the side to the box. So that little flap stays in place. And now I'm going to like kind of make a seam down the left side of the paper, make it nice and sharp, pinch it between my fingers, make a nice little line. And then we're gonna fold that in Try to do this with one hand while I'm filming. Okay, so let's try that again. And I'm just aiming my camera lens at my hand. Doing this one handedly at the moment. Ooh, that worked. So I'm folding it in, seaming it, just making it nice and smooth. Here, okay, at the bottom. Okay, so that's done on that side. Ooh, I could tape that side down. That might be an idea, but I can't do that with one hand. Okay, now to the right side. Okay, so making a seam. Okay, fold that in. Smooth. Smooth. Okay, fold, like press in, pressing the seams so it's nice and tight. Okay, and so now I'm going to fold this up like the voila. And I'm going to put a piece of tape on that like that. Okay, hold on a second. Okay, you guys, so I put the piece of tape on the side right there. So that side is done. So now I'm going to turn it around. And now we have just the one side to go. And then I can flip it over and uh and put a bow on top <laughs> all right i'll show you in a second okay you guys so i got the other side done it was a little longer on that side i had a little extra you know paper but it worked i folded it in taped it up as you can see it works it worked it worked nicely so the girls won't even pay attention it's not completely even but no one's gonna know it looks pretty on top right and yeah I think that looks good. So look, I did it! Yay! It's nice and smooth and sh it feels shiny. And so now I'm gonna go pick out a pretty ribbon, pretty bow, and be done and put it in front of my pretty tree. My beautiful tree, a gorgeous tree that I decorated myself with my hands and my mind. And it's golden, red, and silver, and sparkle, 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 glitter, 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 and a beautiful big bow on top that I made myself. And it, I wired it to the tree. And let's see here, where's it at? <gasps> so pretty. And it's like 2.30 in the morning, so let's get going, Joy. <laughs> right. let's get Voila, bow. you guys. I have this really big red bow. My husband and I picked out the store to put on this package. So red, big, big bow. And I stuck it in the middle as best as I could in the middle of the silver package with the red Santa Clauses on it. What is it? The silver package. Yeah, I said that. A silver package with red Santa Clauses. <laughs> it's so pretty. I am so proud. My husband just showed him and he's proud of me. Not that he doubted me because, you know, I do all this decorating and make bows and you know, yeah, I'm showing my piano and my, I have a beautiful wreath over my piano and arrangements and I've done all of it by myself. So, you know, just because you don't have eyesight doesn't mean you can't do like anything. I mean, like you can do so, so, so much through your other senses. And a lot of people don't understand that you don't have to have eyesight to have vision. And I always say that you don't have to have eyesight to have vision. And I have so much vision. I don't have sight, but I have vision. And I can create beautiful things through my mind's eye and with my hands. And yeah, and I don't even feel blind because I'm seeing it so vividly um, through touch and through my mind. And it's just as beautiful. I do believe it is just as beautiful in my own mind and with my hands as it is uh, through sight. And I can just imagine it all. And it's beautiful. And I focus on my blessings and choosing joy, right? That's what the holidays are about. 
um, being joyful and being grateful, being blessed for what you have. And that's what I am. Anyway, Merry Christmas and love you guys. And I will see you guys in the next video. All right. Bye. Mwah.